Hi everyone, we're here to give you an overview of how company cam features can standardize your daily process to keep your HVAC business running smoothly. Our visual first communication and documentation tools make it easier to keep track of all your jobs with time stamped photos that show the work you did and when it was done. In this demo, we'll show you how to create and name your first project and what happens when you take a photo in company cam. We'll also demonstrate how to tag, annotate, and comment on photos. Let's get started. Today, I'm gonna to show you how easy it is to create a project in company cam. Super simple. What we'll do is open the company cam app. In the top left, we'll hit create project. Company cam will bring up the exact address you're already standing at. From there, we'll hit confirm project location and give our project a name. That project is successfully created. Now you can snap photos in that project. I'm gonna go ahead and select a project and take a deeper dive into how we can annotate these photos. Once I have a photo selected that I wanna mark up, I can easily, at the bottom of the screen, using that little squiggly line that you'll see, I can open that up, which is gonna be my annotation tool. This is gonna drop down a toolbar on the right-hand side of the screen that's gonna provide a variety of options for you to mark up these photos. I can easily take one of these arrows, drag it around, point to a specific area, and I can hit that little T, add some text that says, this is gonna be mold. I can come in here, I can also grab like a circle, come up to a specific area, circle that, add some text there, and say, don't miss this. Other things I can do is freehand draw, so I can you know, scribble on things, direct shapes, anything that you wanna do, making it really easy to visually communicate with your crews and the people back at the office. Once you have all the annotations that you want on the photo, all you have to do is hit save in the bottom right hand corner, and then these things are permanently marked on this photo and immediately back to the office where they need to be. Now that you have a project with a photo gallery, I'm gonna show you how you can share these photos with the customer with the click of a button. All you have to do is hit view all photos. As you can see, that'll pull up your gallery, and then what you'll see is the top left, that create and share button. Once you give that a click, it's gonna present you with a few options as to how you can share these photos. As you can see at the bottom of the screen, if I hit share project timeline, that's just gonna generate a quick hyperlink that I can then have the option to text, email, Facebook message, anything that I wanna do, send that out. Once I hit text, I'm gonna send this to somebody. And once you send this customer the link, they're gonna have automatic updates. These photos are gonna roll in in real time and they're never gonna to have to ask you to send them photos throughout the day. If you're inviting people from the mobile app, go ahead and open up Company Cam. Once on the home screen, there should be a Users and Groups icon for you to tap on, and then select Invite New Users. From there, you can either generate an invite link or manually input the user's information. We also have a contact option where you can allow Company Cam access to your phone contacts. From there, press the plus icon next to any contact you'd like to add, and once everybody has been selected, simply tap Send Invitations. They'll receive a text message inviting them to your Company Cam account. If you're in the Company Cam mobile app, photo comments are a great way to keep you and your team all on the same page. To access photo comments, simply open up the project, select the photo of your choice, and then click on the speech bubble icon. Here, you can tap the blue at button and select your user from the user dropdown. This will allow you to post any comment you want while notifying that user. They'll get something similar to a text message in their company cam app, directing them to that photo you specifically commented on, keeping everyone all on the same page instantly. Let's take a look at checklist. Choose the project you'd like to create your list for, then tap checklist or make a checklist. From here, you'll see any existing checklists that exist or you can create a brand new one. To create your new checklist, tap new checklist and new checklist. Make sure to give your list a title, then tap create checklist to get started. From here, you can start adding tasks individually or you can create a section to create more organization within your task. Each task will require a photo. This setting will turn on right away when you create your first task, but you can always toggle this off if that task does not require a photo. You also have the ability to add questions to your task to gather more information from your team in the field. You have a yes or no question. You also have the ability to include a rating scale. 
a open text box response, or a multiple choice where you can input the answers and your crew can select everything that applies for that specific task. In addition to adding a photo to your task, you'll also need to answer the questions before you can complete your task. So if we back out to our main app home screen of that checklist, you'll see the questions there. We can go ahead and answer that. And we know a photo is required, so we can tap the camera icon that'll take us right to the camera screen where we can take a photo on the spot. Or if we open that task again by tapping on the title, we'll have the option to add photos that already exist in our project. Tap add photos, you'll see the option to take photos and then add photos from project. We'll choose one for this task, hit add to save it to your list. Now that we've completed everything, we can check off our task and move on to the next thing in our list. Company Cam is already gonna be the best field capture tool out there in the business today. What's beautiful about this is now we're gonna be able to use our software to get your field capture back into your other software faster through our integrations. How our integrations work is a job is gonna be created within your CRM or any of your other platforms that pushes it as a project into Company Cam itself. When we're out in the field, all we have to do is open up the app. That project will be waiting right there for you. You take your field capture in there, it's instantaneously going back into your centralized hub along with who took that photo, where that photo was taken, when that photo was taken. Here are some of our integration partners to kind of help you get started and see how some of these work. But now you're gonna get that information faster with less steps using Company Cam. I wanna show you how easy it is to create a report in the field. Obviously, it can be kind of troublesome when you take a bunch of photos, then have to run back to your office, try to compile a report, and then get it sent off. So Company Cam makes it super simple and easy to take your photos and generate a report right there. Once you have all your documentation done, all you're gonna to wanna to do is just hop into that project there and then view your photos and select which photos you're gonna need for the report. You can simply hold your finger down and select which photos, or you can select them by the day. But once you have the photos that you need, go to the bottom right hand corner and then hit create report. This is then gonna prompt you to give the report a name and then select how many photos you want per page. And then from there, it'll automatically set up a cover page for you with your business name and logo, as well as compile all your photos into a section. This can then be renamed as well as summarized up at the top, and then you can individually break down and annotate what's going on on the photos themselves. Now you know the basics, let's take a deeper dive on how Company Cam can benefit your business. Schedule a live walkthrough today.